I want to revisit a topic that I brought up in a Friday update uh, earlier this year. So I was seeing an ADHD coach who was just awesome at helping me get better at all kinds of things, uh, showing up on time, getting things done. One of the things that she had taught me was uh, about my owner's manual. So every good thing that you buy is going to come with an owner's manual of if you want it to operate at this level, then this is what you need to do to get it to operate at that level. And when you look at the owner's manual, you go, okay, that's the thing. You know, as long as I do these things, I know I will be successful. And when I did the video earlier this year, I talked about having created my own owner's manual and I did. And in fact, it's, it's right here in front of me. I've got a lot of things in my owner's manual. So if I'm ever like not doing so well, you know, my attitude's just not there. I'm waking up frustrated. I always go back to the owner's manual and every time I do, I go, Oh yeah, there's things I'm not doing. Like I know that if I do these things, I will be successful. So I talked earlier this year about it. If you're not doing it yet, get an owner's manual, start writing down. Like these are the things that make me the best version of myself. My update to that is the two things at the very top of my owner's manual are running and floating. And I injured my knee earlier this year and I can't run and the float place that I float at just closed. So the two top things that I wrote when I sat down to, to figure out what makes me the best version of myself, those two things don't exist for me anymore. What I found was when I couldn't run, I didn't plug anything in right away to solve for that. And when the float place closed down, I didn't add anything that would replace that floating. And so the message I want you to hear now is create your owner's manual and check it frequently. And then if you lose something where you're not able to do it, then go back to it and go, okay, well then what's going to take the place of that? So I just joined a gym last week and now I'm going to the gym and now that's going to take place of running in my owner's manual to get that dopamine hit, to get that rush going so that I can be the best version of myself. But as things change, if you don't repair those things and come up with different things that you can do, then you're going to see yourself slide a little bit. And I think everybody's experienced that. So if you haven't written your owner's manual, take a second and write it out. These are the things that make me the best version of myself. And then after you've done that, just keep checking back, keep checking back, and then make those changes frequently because this does change over time and you want to always be the best version of yourself. There you go. We'll see you next week.